I think I've always been very interested in human beings and the rules that govern our interactions, our social kind of behaviors. Um, but the specific interest for torture uh, really comes from my work with the International Committee of the Red Cross, which I've worked for for 12 years as a delegate in the field. I've visited hundreds, maybe thousands even, of detainees in uh, prisoners of war and uh, secret service detainees and so on. And uh, unfortunately, sometimes I've been confronted also with uh, stories of, of ill treatment and so on. So that's where this really comes from. Torture, sadly, still is a uh, very real part of many of the contexts of conflict and violence we're confronted with today. Um, I believe that uh, a lot of progress has been made in uh, awareness, uh, but on the other hand, what I can also witness and what really worries me um, is not maybe the most dramatic context, just like as the war in Syria, which is obviously a tragic event, but is that there is some kind of a creeping development of increased tolerance, uh, maybe not even on the part of governments, but in society generally for uh, certain forms of treatment that can only be described as torture. It is obviously a big honor, but also a big responsibility, even bigger responsibility, I'd say, um, to assume this type of role. I think the first thing one has to realize is that one cannot save the world single-handedly as a special rapporteur. And what is great in this thematic area is that there are dozens, if not hundreds, of stakeholders, organizations, NGOs, but also UN agencies and uh, individual experts that have been working on these issues for decades and have done excellent work. So obviously, my role will not be to replace all of this, but perhaps to be able to give an added value in facilitating that work, maybe uh, having the independence of a special rapporteur, I can pick up issues that have remained under the radar of the international community so far, uh, bring those to the, the agenda, to the table, and, and bring the other stakeholders to the table as well, and try to, to cooperate on these issues.